Welcome, um, Aries. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is your call to reading for business, career, money, wealth, and finance. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and support. Affluation is here for you guys. So in this three months period, um, affirmation is the sense you're beginning with a wheel of fortune, some sort of an issue from the past is coming back for you to deal with and you're handing with a hermit. So, um, Aries, what this is basically saying is that some of you have done some thing, um, at work in the past or at another job and, uh, now the truth is coming out and people are finding out, um, what you Aries have done. It could be some sort of a, uh, it could be a, another work affiliation, another job, some sort of a references. Um, something could have happened at a job. Someone is asking um, about you, Aries. They're finding out things that did not come up when you apply for the job. That sort of a situation is coming up. So be aware of that. Now, the Seven of Cups is in reverse. So I see a lot of you, Aries, are going to be up hunting for new um, work, new jobs, that sort of a thing could be coming up for you, Aries, where um, the opportunities that you thought would have been there is not there. And I see a lot of you are trying to open up new possibilities for you guys. So I see that the situation is alarming for some of you. Um, and I see that some sort of information comes out about you, Aries, and that has uh, created some sort of a blockage for you, okay? So some of you, Aries, was, um, you know, going, um, was things was happening for you. Um, you were open to everything and anything, but I see some sort of a bad references is going to be coming out, and some of you, Aries, um, they could be finding out that some of you had connection to a group of people and um, whether this group of people is, it could be a situation at your whole job or it could be a situation where um, the friends in your private life um, have affected your world and make a, a whole lot of changes. So I see you Aries are going to be having issues to deal with and it's some sort of a emotional issues because Doors that was open up for you, Aries, is now closed because of some sort of a secrecy um, that comes out. So remember to like, share, and support this channel by um, thumbs up, set your notification buttons on. If you'd like to see the extended of this reading, Aries, you can use the link below in order to go um, towards the extended of this reading. You can join and become a member. Use any one of uh, um, the abundant, the higher you go is the more um, extra information you get per month. So be aware of this. So I want to say to you, Aries, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful like, shares and support and uh, the admiration um, that you give out. Let's look at the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune is something from the past. So some of you, Aries, could have gotten a job or did something um, at another company in the past and something, um, someone, um, have been looking and investigating you Aries and going back in your past, whatever the reason is and whatever, um, that came up, I see, um, they are doing this to you. So the fire sign of the wheel of fortune is coming up, um, in the month of January. Okay. So you are having some sort of a past issue returning in your world so you have to be aware of this and it is some sort of information something that you Aries did in the past is going to be um, coming up in January that you have to face and resolve so you have the wheel of fortune and uh, um, another major arcana the hermit that is showing up some sort of a um um, past issues that is going to be affecting your career and your business and um, wealth at this time. So be aware of this. Um, then when we look at February, February is the six of swords at end. 
I end this coming up. So some of you, your business could be ending. Some of you, a contract could be ending because some sort of a secrecy comes out. Um, so if you notice, um, whatever the secrecy is and whatever that you Aries have been connected in the past, uh, your past is coming back to haunt you now in the future when it comes to work, job. I see ends, I end uh, um, to some sort of an issue, a karmatic. Uh, um, the Wheel of Fortune is always as if uh, some sort of a financial situation, some issues. Uh, um, it could be coming to an end for some of you, for some of you. It could be that uh, a job or a project or a business is going to be coming to an end because they realize either it's not your information or you have been falsely accessing and using someone else's information and they're finding out what you have done. Um, in the month of March, I see the eye princess, the energy of the eye princess, some sort of a secrecy. I think a Pisces could have thrown you Aries onto the bus. So there is some sort of a secrecy if you're connected or if your boss is an Aries um, or your boss is a Pisces. The Pisces have thrown you Aries onto the bus. The Pisces have known your secret and find out your secret and have thrown you onto the bus. So what we're looking at here is that, um, was it a business for it? Was not, was it an ex colleague? Is it an ex Is it a colleague on the floor that have, uh, you have done something? They went back and they really got you this time because I see um, that you Aries are going to be surprised at what has happened and transpired. So um, you're dealing with issues from the past. Some so, uh, Aquarian um, is investigation. Um, they were investigating you Aries past and found out a lot of secrets. Uh, and uh, um, the opportunities and the doors that was open for some of you is going to be closed. Now, all of you, remember, this is a general reading. Um, so um, it, it is a situation that you have to be aware of, uh, um, you know, whatever you have done to a colleague in the past, they have uh, come back and got you um, this time. OK, it, it's as if this. The, you took some sort of a revenge on a colleague and they went back and they hit you and they hit you hard. So some sort of a secrecy of getting rid of a colleague again and work against a colleague, a whole colleague, a whole employer or employee. They came back for you and you were down. There is no um, returning to um, this situation because... Um, they really get back to you. And this is what I'm, I say to a lot of people before you are going to be anything you decide to do against another day. It always come back. You know, whenever you think that, um, you know, you get rid of a person, and you're happily and, and, and you thought, oh, whoo, I made it. You're going to be realizing unexpectedly that this is happening. A lot of you are going to be dealing with an Aquarian. Aquarian is going to be telling your secrets. There's some sort of an investigation that is going on about your past. Um, um, a whole lot of um, um, information came out. So you guys are dealing with an Aquarian um, and a Scorpion, um, a Pisces. Um, the energy of the, the magician has to do with... Uh, um, you guys are trying to create, uh, using magic to create your world. Um, but it's, n it, it, you know, some of you use uh, magic um, to get you in position and to get your jobs and it's going to be ending. So, um, you know, like people who use uh, um, witchcraft or whatever to get, you in higher position or get your business is going to be ending because if you notice um we're going now in the aquarian time we're getting out of the pisces time going in the aquarian time and that means uh, the aquarians are the one that uh, um create magic because they're the air energy and they're ending it um because you're a fire sign so you have to understand the elements and who you are and if you had done something against an Aquarian in the past, I see an Aquarian is coming back and ending the magic to witchcraft. Whatever you did to get in a company, a job, or a situation, an Aquarian is ending it. An Aquarian um, is coming in and saying, no, what you have done, 
um, was injustice. So you could have done this Aquarian, and that is it with water, fire, um, air sign people. Um, you, they will give you the thing as if they have forgotten about what you have done and let it go. Um, but this person, together with a scorpion, a scorpion told this uh, um, Aquarian what you have done. And they're coming back and they're blazing you down. So be aware of um, what is transpiring. So um, a lot of you have really created some sort of issues and problems in the past for an employee or employer. And now they're coming back and they're um, really, um, you know, using their power um, to show you that, you know, the injustice that you have done to them. Um, they never forgot it and they're here and they're repaying you your karma that you give out to them. So I see um, this is what is coming up and transpiring. Um, this is very um, serious and I think uh, a lot of you should think what you do to another person. I want to say um, if you would like to see the extended of this reading, um, you can follow us. If not, I'm wishing you a wonderful month. What I should really say, because this is from January till March, um, a whole lot of you who have been honestly, you know, living up to expectation, it's going to be um, given to you. OK, so if you're an honest person who just go to your work, work hard, you don't use it a witchcraft or that sort of a thing. You don't hurt people. You just try to create your own magic in your own world. I see that this is going to be helping you, moving you and pushing you forward in a very wonderful direction. Um, if you'd like to see the um, rest of this reading, you can follow us. If not, I'm saying namaste until next time. Um, Happy New Year and I will speak to you soon.